Welcome back. Meteorologist Dylan Goday here with a look at the uh, sunrise from this morning in Perryville. Beautiful sunrise. We saw some great color there as clouds were pushing in from the west. As you looked towards that eastern sky, still saw some sunshine and that allowed uh, for some beautiful color in the sky. Thank you to Kimberly Ritchie uh, for sending that uh, photo to our Facebook page. A live look at the Kentucky Horse Park on our Bluegrass Pace Care Sky View. Again, the cloud cover from this morning has passed and we've got clear skies out there and it's really going to be with us through the rest of your day today. Temperatures ranging from the low 50s into southeast Kentucky to the mid 50s like we're seeing here in Lexington. Even starting to see some upper 50s towards the Lake Cumberland region. Monticello right now sitting at 57 degrees. Max HU radar and satellite showing a little bit of cloud cover still into eastern Kentucky. Radar tried to pick up some light rain there as well. Not seeing that reach the ground uh, thanks to the drier air that is in place. A weak little front passed just to our east and notice all the dry conditions and clear conditions off towards the west. Futurecast does keep uh, those skies clear for this afternoon. We'll be reaching, as we said, mid to upper 50s. Think Futurecast is downplaying those temperatures because we're already sitting at the mid to upper 50s uh, right now. As you head into the overnight hours, we'll start to see some cloud cover building in by tomorrow morning and that'll be with us. Uh, for most of the day tomorrow. So for your Valentine's Day, expect some cloud cover, especially into the second half of the day. Now we should stay dry during the daylight hours. It's not until the late evening that we will start to see some rain moving into central Kentucky. So be prepared for that eight, nine o'clock, starting to see some rain moving into areas just to our west. Uh, and that'll move through really between eight, nine o'clock through just past midnight. So if you do have some late evening plans, uh, be prepared for some damp roads on that drive home and maybe pack the umbrella with you as well. Don't want uh, your date tomorrow to get wet thanks to the rain. Now as you head towards your Wednesday morning, starting off with some cloud cover, but we should clear on out nicely towards the afternoon. Look at those temperatures, upper 60s, low 70s uh, by your Wednesday afternoon. You may be wondering, how's that not our go day? Today's the go day. Well because we're going to see some very gusty winds Wednesday. Not as gusty as they were uh, last week, but still likely to see some wind gusts from that. So here's a look at the upper level pattern here. Wednesday, we got this high pressure off the east coast in combination with this area low pressure towards the west, and that's going to funnel in the warmth. That's why we're going to be well above average, low to mid 70s in store. Notice the rain and the potential for some storms rolling on in starting late to Wednesday night into your Thursday morning. As the cold front moves in from the west, we will see those rain chances increase uh, again Thursday evening. Again, could see some storms and potentially some stronger storms Thursday before this cold front exits eastward. And we're going to see a big drop in those temperatures. We're going to stay into the 30s on Friday. So we do have a severe uh, risk for your Thursday. A large area included within this from central Kentucky includes portions of western Kentucky as well. And we've been monitoring this risk the Storm Prediction Center has since Saturday for Thursday. So it's been some time uh, that they've been watching this. So future cast rainfall totals through Thursday could see some heavier rain in northern Kentucky and another batch could be possible into southern Kentucky as well. So the rest of your Monday, mostly sunny and mild today, 60 degrees tonight, 33, mostly clear and pretty quiet overnight. Here's a look at that Valentine's Day forecast as well. Tracking some late rain temperatures, though, mild 62 degrees for your day tomorrow. There's a look at that seven day forecast windy Wednesday and Thursday with rain and storms moving in on Thursday as well.